What it do? What it do? What it do, y'all? What it do, y'all? It's your boy DZ. <laughs> what it do youtube it's your boy dz uh today is part of uh, i would say a two or three part series i'm not sure how long yet but we got a package in the mail pack in the mail it's gone uh. we're actually getting new front flares because you know long story short two days before h2o i wanted to try this new gas station that i've never been to ended up being uneven pavement pulling my splitter off breaking that flexing my bumper and breaking the flares on uh breaking the flares in the front so that's bad vibes altogether i've been having them on with slap stickers for the longest so that looks mad ratchet so basically now what we're gonna do i learned a trick because they were painted so paint chips after a while especially with all the driving i do I'm gonna get them wrapped by one of my homies we're gonna take a trip there now what we're gonna do also we're gonna make them two pieces opposed to one piece so if the bumper does happen to flex We'll go ahead and take care of that and it won't affect anything else. So uh, stay tuned. Today we're just going to unbox it and then we're going to get some cut in. And then uh, you'll see. Stay tuned. <laughs> From uh, HDOs, we're gonna crack this open. Uh, yeah, you got a knife, bro? Whatever, man. Alright, let me see. I might have mine in here. Alright, so we got some flareage in here. We got some hardware in there. Man, I almost cracked your shit. <laughs> Things off. And then we're gonna oh, fit this to here. Then we're gonna see where we gotta cut. Shout out to Nick's boy over there. We got this jack. It's like an automatic jack. We're in 2020. He's in 2040 right now. So uh, let's get this shirt underneath the pink bone. And... Bro, nah, look at this. I'm gonna bring the whip down. Pull it up. Nah, son. Nah, bro, I need this. I need this. Yeah, so I didn't even have to bring the 1940s jack over here. Nah, you didn't, bro. This is crazy. This plugs right into the cigarette. Yo, it probably would go faster if the car was on, but yeah, I'm, yeah. Not, I'm not doing it. Whatever. Man. This is crazy. So we have the flare on there. What we're gonna mark it is right here. We're probably gonna put some adhesive, well not adhesive, but like double-sided tape right here. So this doesn't go flopping off once I hit 80 miles an hour. This is gonna be fine. That just needs to be adhesed and all of that is fine. Yeah. 
Safety first. <laughs> Shout out to Nick. Nick actually had a great idea. He's back here chopping that up. This actually came out really clean. Let's see how this one came out. Pretty mint, bro. Nice. Yeah, it looks good, bro. All right, we got one more side to go. One more side to go. I don't even want to record that, to be honest, because this was a pain. That's going to be a pain. It's the same thing on both sides. We'll just show you uh, what it looks like at the end. And if you're wondering, oh, DZ, oh, why are you cutting up perfectly brand new flares? I'm gonna drop a picture. The picture's gonna be right here. That's where I took the fattest L last year. Well, one of the fattest Ls, two days, bro, two days before H2O, I was dumb sick, but I hit some uneven pavement, smoked both of my flares on the same side, and my splitter, bro. So I'm done taking Ls, bro. We've been proactive 2020. You know the vibes, bro. We're being proactive you know 2020. <laughs> All right. All right, so Fitman looks a little doo-doo now, but what we're going to do, when we get the new bumper, we have to drill new holes anyways. So we're going to move it up slightly, and then the Fitman hey, is going to be mixed. It should sag in anyway. Yeah, whatever. So, no, <laughs> so, I'm just saying, once, this, once the new bumper is on, that shit's going to be mixed. Yeah, facts. So overall, it's good. Once we push these together, it'll be fine. So we're just waiting on the new bumper from Sal, from Paint. And then we're gonna drill a new hole into it, get this lined up pretty well. But for now, that's all. Uh, this is part one of uh, what? What is it? Three, three parts. Two, three. Because like nah, that. the next part is gonna be we're gonna be up in Fishkill getting these wrapped, and then we should do the weather stripping and all that at the same time. Or, mounting. Yeah. So I mean, I guess a part two series or well, two part series, maybe a three part series. Who knows? We're gonna see. But um, yeah, stay tuned for more. The vibes. <laughs> You gotta do it. You gotta do it too, oh. bro. Gotta... I won't never tell my soul.